Hey, it's Matt at Rough House Studios, and welcome to my review of the Tick Vaporizer from Aris. Before we get started, I would like to thank the guys at Aris Tech for sending out the Tick and for sponsoring this review. If you'd like to learn more about Aris Tech products, please visit aristech.com. Now let's get started. Here's what comes in the box with the Tick Vaporizer. You get the Tick Vaporizer unit itself. There's a little accessories package. In it, you have the two brass rings that couple it to the cartridges and also the micro USB charging cable. The instructions are on the back of the box. All right, now let's take a closer look at the Tick unit itself. It's a really nice, elegant design. You can see the bottom plate is a metal plate with a screw on so you could uh, access the batteries. It's a micro USB charging port on the side. And then there's one single function button on the front. It's got a hinged top like a Zippo lighter. It flips open like that. Inside you have the, the port that you put your cartridge down into. It fits almost any size 510 cartridges. Oh, that's like e-cig juice type cartridges and there's a little slit in the side so you can see the the cartridge and the fill level and then we have these two brass rings that are magnetized and these are fittings that will fit various size cartridges into the tick now keep in mind it does not include any cartridges it's just the vaporizer battery itself and the fittings that will hook it to various size cartridges and then it has a magnetic fitting inside and as you can see there the little slit lets you see the quantity of your a cartridge and then it's got that swing top that completely conceals and protects the cartridge now we'll get the tick charged up and take a look at the functions and features you can see that there's a little red light there that will stay on while it's charging and then when it's fully charged the light goes off you power the tick with five clicks of the button it has three different settings that you can access with three clicks of the button green is 3.4 volts uh, then the blue is 3.7 volts and red is high at 4 volts. So nice variable voltage function. It cuts off with five clicks and that's it. It's really simple to use as far as the functions and features. And now for my favorite part as always, it's the usage and testing. So I'm going to load it up with a cartridge of some rosin made wax there in my e-cig cartridge. I'm going to put it on high because I like to get the big puffs, especially for the camera there. If they're small puffs, it looks like the vaporizer is not doing a good job, so I have to get the big puffs. And it did not let me down. It got really good, nice puffs off of it, really good flavor. And uh, it was really nice to have the variable voltage. I left it on high pretty much the whole time because I'm a bit of a hog, but it is nice to have the lower voltage if you have different kinds of cartridges or if you just want smaller, smoother hits. Uh, I really did like the performance of it. I love that swing top that covers up the cartridge, you know, so you don't break it in your pocket. But let's look at the pros and cons. It's got that perfect size 650 milliamp battery, the compact, elegant design that I really like with the cap that protects and conceals the cartridges, the varial voltage, which is really nice if you want different types of um, cartridges or different types of hits. And it fits almost any kind of 510 cartridges. Comes in three colors, red, white, and black. And I really had no cons to mention on this one. I'm going at five stars. Aristec Tick Vaporizer is a really cool, it's innovative and nice way to do your cartridges without breaking them and it's really discreet. So if you want to learn more about it and Aristec products, visit aristec.com. And again, thanks to those guys for setting up this review. Hope you enjoyed this review of the Aristec Tick. If you did, hit the like button. And subscribe to Rough House Studios for more cannabis culture videos made just for you. This is Matt for Rough House Studios. Thank you for watching.